Good afternoon, everybody on YouTube. This is Rick Thomas from Obsolete Video Services. Hey, guys. All right. You know how I've been talking about Goodwill these past couple days? Um, just want to show you guys another Goodwill score. And this was quite surprising because I know these are expensive. And uh, even if you can buy them online, they're not really cheap at all. <laughs> and anyways, uh, I was in the local Goodwill today. As you can see, I got my VR7000 machine, rare of the rare machines, and of course the other very extremely rare machine, the Sony AV5000A. Anyways, um, you know in my little living room area here, I gotta make as much space as I can because I, I'd like to always have everything in racks just to get everything out of the way. And if it rolls on wheels, it makes it a little easier. You never know if you have to move things around. So having things on wheels is a must. Considering how expensive this gear is and how heavy this gear is. Um, here at Obsolete Video Services, we are redesigning every day. The studio is being tweaked, redesigned, more user-friendly, more Obsolete Video equipment, you name it. And I'm trying to have online or at my disposal one piece of equipment uh, one of each of the most obsolete video formats so if somebody walks through my door I'll be able to transfer it on the spot for them a lot of people make give me phone calls saying can you do this obsolete format do you have it do you have it do you have it so if I have one available and if I can make everything really condensed and one available and up and running that's work that I will not lose and money that I will not, that I'll be able to make so you don't want to lose out on a customer job, especially something vintage. If it's really obsolete video, you know you're going to make a pretty good dollar on it if you can do it. But you don't want to lose the business if you're not set up for it. So here at Obsolete Video Services, we are set up for um, gratitude of multiple, multiple different formats. It's just ridiculous. So anyways, we are condensing everything in my living room. Recently, like I said, this past year, we got this beautiful table desk that we now use as a desk compared to the one that I did have. Um, we, just picked, we just picked up all these three broadcast decks from my good friend Tony, which these are now up online. I can actually use them if I need to do tape transfers on a specialized rack that I had since the 1988, 89 and so that's up on the rack. Plus, we got this lift cart for very heavy stuff for on the spot stuff. But what I want to talk about today is at Goodwill, I just got another score. Now, check this out. This is a rollaway cart, right? Have you guys looked at the prices on rollaway carts online? They're not cheap, especially since it's steel. This is a steel rollaway cart, and these are not cheap. You go online. These shipping places that even sell these customized carts on wheels that are made of steel, a couple hundred bucks or more and higher. They're not cheap. They're, I've seen go one similar to this online was almost, was almost $400. These are not cheap. Solid steel rollaway cart. Anyways, I saw it at Goodwill and they had it for $12. $12. I could not believe it. Solid steel industrial rollaway cart for 12 bucks are you kidding me i i i, I just I, I couldn't believe it and i saw this and of course i had use for it for my two rare machines i needed i wanted to have something i could roll around on and be able to move these these heavy machines on when i get them all on this cart especially like the vr 7000 and the av 5000a these are very heavy machines but this cart really suited what i needed i kind of knew it by the dimensions but Anyways, I just wanted to show you, I'll have access to these two machines now. I am sitting here, so I don't have to be fighting moving them around. They're now on wheels, but this is a heavy-duty, solid, thick-gauge cart, okay? And it's got like a nice little painted design on it, which is kind of cool. $12. I mean, what were they smoking back there when they put prices on these things? I mean, it's funny as hell. Anyways, another Goodwill, serious Goodwill score, 12 buck item, which is worth several, several hundreds of dollars if you buy one of these, especially online, they're not cheap. I just wanted to show you this, guys. It's got a nice flat steel grain type of top, solid steel, bottom shelf, which is also solid steel, on casters, 
on you know, very heavy duty looking uh, type of casters, not those cheap flimsy ones. And here we are able to house the, uh, the VR7000 Ampex and the Sony AV5000A. So I can have these side by side if I need to pull from these two machines. Plus when I start doing my video transfers on the VR7000 and the 7500, I've got a cart that's user friendly that I can move around. Goodwill is your friend. Get there at five o'clock, guys. Use your head. Yeah, I mean, a lot of the stuff is very expensive. They don't know what they're what the type of prices they're putting on these things. You could get what you need for your own studio, or whatever you might be doing. I mean, video equipment, specialized racks, carts, all kinds of things. You never know what's going to be donated at Goodwill. I don't know where this came from because this is heavy duty steel, and this uh, this came from. Maybe a store or something. I, I mean, you, you can't even buy these. They're super expensive. So anyways, guys, I wanted to show you that. Another Goodwill score, a heavy-duty uh, industrial uh, uh, rollaway cart, upper and lower, on wheels, perfect length for these two machines. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video.